guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do an update for my Finish 20 in 2020 project pan and I'm doing okay. I have some good progress but I only have one empty but it is an exciting empty. It is a makeup product. That is exciting. Last time I had five empties or something so not as good as this time around. Let's just take the empty shall we? It is my W7 Very Vegan HD Foundation, this one right here. I have used it every single day and I can finally call it done. <laughs> I'm so happy that this is done. I scraped everything I, out that I could. I have been mixing it so much that I might even finish another foundation this month. <laughs> the one that I'm mixing with everything. Yeah, this was definitely time to go. And I'm really excited to call it an empty for April. Should we just take the replacement when we are here? I don't know if that, this is a good idea or not. Um, probably not. It is the W7 Touch and Go Blemish Concealer Pencil. This is not a concealer. It is in my concealer inventory, but it's not a concealer at all. Because it is illuminating. It has a sheen. There's this kind of pencil, you know? I would call it a highlight pencil. Because that sheen... That cannot be on a blemish. Why is this called a blemish concealer? Because No, no. <laughs> so I'm going to use this in my inner corner and on my brow bone as a base. And I do think it is going to work for that because it is a, a little bit creamy. So I think it is going to be a nice base for some eyeshadow. This is my replacement product. And I have never finished any one of these. So I don't know how far it is going to go down. But I need to use it. We have my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NW15. I will insert some progress pictures. This is getting so hard to pump out. Like I can see down the middle besides the tubing thing. There's a hole. And when you get to that point, the product is so hard to pump out of this. <laughs> and there's always something stuck to the bottom. So I'm banging it every single morning <laughs> and pumping like 10 times maybe more to get some what product out so this is empty soon which i'm excited for i want to talk to you guys about this eye primer first of all this is the w7 i got the power all day wear eye primer this one right here and my progress for last month i was down to here and i was like there's not that much product left because i was squeezing all the way up and i was just like let me just get the rest of it out into a small container like this one travel size face moisturizer thing and just use it from there because it was really hard to get out this was a few weeks after the update i regretted trying to do that immediately because it kept going it kept going and there was not just like a week left or something no no dude this is completely full how can this be how 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 <laughs> how i don't know this is insane it's definitely not drying out so that is good it's not the whole container it has like a dip in the packaging so it's not entirely full but you know there is a lot of product and this will last me months months to get through and i was really really happy about my progress but it kept going kept going i'm so sad i'm so sad because i really thought this was going to be done by this update but i definitely not by by summer maybe maybe by summer if we're lucky I haven't used this P2 Impressive Deal Gel Eyeliner in Dramatic Blue. I've been trying to focus on my Black Gel Eyeliner. I have used this a couple of times, the Double Prime from W7. It is a lip primer. Let me see very quick if I have any um, progress. Nope. Nope. Used it maybe twice. Then we have my W7 Eye Dream Shadow Cream and I was down to there last time and I'm kind of at the same mark. This is getting dry as well. 
I have used oil and oil and oil and oil but it is still drying out and I have a hard time using this. I think I'm going to call it quit by next update because it's only on the sides and I have a such a hard time to get it out. And I did remove the stopper, so yeah. I have used so much oil that it's not even funny and it keeps drying out. So maybe it's just time to go. This is my The Balm Bon Jovi Cream Blush in like vanilla, I want to say. It is the red one. I just watched Rebecca panning and stuff. Her, it's not her latest update, but oh, maybe it is her partners in cream. Maybe it was for a month ago uh, for the March update. She finished this. I've been working on this for more than a year and it's not done yet. Oh, that's annoying. I know she, is, has, she has a deeper complexion than me. I'm pale as paper. And that might be why. But mm, I, I'm packing this on every single morning. I look like a clown before I put on foundation. And yes, I, my cheeks are bright pink underneath this foundation from this blush every single day and I did push it to one side so I could use it better oh my god I have no idea how I'm going to get through that but I'm going to do it this year but I just said that Rebecca started after me and she finished before me I don't know how you do it girl but credit to you oh my god you did good okay I have used my NYX powder blush in taupe a lot use it as a contour I have no idea if you can see any progress at all but I have a slight dip which is exciting and the pattern is kind of wearing off it's really really obvious in the viewfinder but in person they are really wearing off I think yeah I have tried to use it more this month but I don't think I have succeeded with that I have my Franken bronzer in this um, Bourjois powder compact and yeah this is where I am now. So you can see there's a speck of pan right there but I'm not counting it because it's not flattened out so it will naturally be pan. I think it is some of the cracks where it has just expanded a little bit and just pan is happening. but. I, I don't care. I really like the sponsor and I'm excited for the pen. There's no battery. Why is there no battery? I hate my life. I have my Madness Natura Salt and Body Scrub. I have made a pen in this. So this will be done by one or two updates, I think. I really, really love this. I use it all over my body. I have some progress on the perfume. I was almost sure that I didn't. I marked it with nail polish because a, a line could not be marked on this wood uh, marker for some reason. But I have the tiniest amount of progress and I'm happy about it. Some great progress on this Glow It All Serum from W7. Look at that progress. Oh my god, I'm really excited about that. And I think this is the most progress as well on my Skin Academy Pure Cleansing Facial Scrub. Love this stuff. I use it every single time in the shower and it is squirting out now. So it will be done by next update. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. The rest I will insert pictures of if I have any progress. Otherwise, I don't think I have. I don't think I have bottom on this. No, not yet. Body lotion. Otherwise, I will end this video before my battery cut me, cuts me off because, oh my god, this has been a struggle to film. I hope you guys enjoyed this update and this series. I will plug in the pictures if I have any progress to show you guys on the rest of the products in this project. I hope that is okay with you guys. I don't want to wait to film the outro of this project. I hope you guys enjoy it and please stay safe out there in these crazy times. And yeah, I just hope you are going to take care. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.